What's going on everyone? It's Greg back with some more Mirror 4 and today we're going to continue on our Incomparable Master um, Mystery Quest and we're on Lightning King Chion Co Yo. I don't know if I said that right, so I'm sorry. Let's just go ahead and dive right into it. Let's start with clue number one. Clue number one says everyone sought after it, but no, now no one wants it. This fan is, well, it's mine then. So we're going to go ahead and move. I know exactly where we need to go. We're going to go to the center shire. We're going to go to trading post and we need to go out here. And of course it is showing now. We did have to unlock a request and let me go ahead and talk about that real quick before we jump over there. The request you needed to do to unlock this was in spiritual center. And let's go down here. It is the labyrinth one. Um, I believe it was this one right here. Not a lot of difference. And if you go to this quest, you're not going to be able to do it right away. You need to click on the uh, clue on the left hand side. It'll tell you the name of the previous one and then the previous one for it. Then you have to go to that one and you'll see the previous one for that and so on and so forth. You work your way back and then work and then just go through those quests to work your way up. It's probably, you know, like a little line of like four or five different things to do. And then once you complete this, sometimes it could be a little buggy and you might need to go visit Spiritual Center. Well, actually, I think you do either way. After you finish this, you need to just go visit Spiritual Center on the map and it will go ahead and trigger the mystery quest for you. So that's how I opened it. And I'm not sure if I, I think I was trying to make a separate video on this, but I don't think I did. So just keep that in mind. Need to unlock that and complete it. So we're going to go to trading post to talk to Yeo. Let's go ahead and do that. We're going to go where, where, where the best place. I think it was the query, right? Yeah, it's our best spot. All right, so we're going to hop up here and then we're going to fly across and we'll do a double fly. Yeah, we need to do it. Well, we'll just do a little jump at the end there. And we're going to talk to Yeo and we get our first clue she's happy to see us and let's see small cave and energy gathering site of phantom woods meet master shion and it will be a great honor for you too all right so it sounds like we need to go see him see what our next clue is clue number two says the young lord the old man spoke of sondok doesn't feel good to receive a treasure like this from sondok still treasures treasure so guys one thing i want to keep in mind here is and let you guys know about is what I learned recently through a friend of mine is that the English version of the game is actually lacking in many ways. So one of those ways really comes down to translations. And I, I guess I can't say many ways. It's really lacking in the translations is what I'm trying to say. And so the issue there is that um, I found out that in the like the Portuguese version it's actually a lot more detailed in the mystery quest and it tells you a lot more just like I couldn't figure out what the level requirement was on the last scroll I did whereas my friend could see it on the Portuguese version it just doesn't show at all on the English version so keep that in mind um, it's probably why a lot of people are searching this out and it just I don't know maybe they'll improve it over time but right now it's just pretty poor so I'm look I have to dig through a lot of information to be able to pull this all together to show you guys so they're talking about Phantom Woods. Let's go take a look here. Phantom Woods Energy Gathering Site is where we want to go. All right, now up here, I believe it's somewhere on the hill. Let's see here. We'll go up here. No, I think the boss just tried to hit me. Well, sometimes you catch a lip here. Nope, I'm not going to catch a lip here. Let's go on the other side. and hop up here can we get up here yeah keep out where we gotta go here I'm pretty sure it's up here yeah I see the green light so that's where we're headed so this is above the energy site and boom there we go oh so you wanna fight yeah we're gonna fight okay boom Level 79. And let's see how we do here. Oh, there we go. Now he wants to talk, huh? So. 
Oh, you sounded kind of uh, a little scary right now. I'm gonna hold back if you keep disparaging the hero named the Lightning King, okay? But I'm Chion Co. Don't get too excited. I only wanted to test your skills briefly. Oh, there we go. It's always about the testing the skills, huh? That power, you're really the Lightning King? Please forgive me, Master Shion. You won't live very long if you're nice and dim with it. Ah, it worries me. Then again, it's not my problem. But I can't have you, whatever. There's something I need, but unable to get myself. There's a girl by name of Yu Yui-sun from Phantom Woods. Okay, let's see what the clue says. Got my hands on the Bishan Talisman, one of the Bishan Royal Treasures. But, hmm, I can't give up like this. Let's start all over again. I swear I'll find the culprit. Alright, so to continue here, actually we can look on the map and we see the scroll. There she is. I think it's a she. I hope it's a she. Let's find out. Yes, it is a she. And we're going to talk to her. There we go. So we got our next clue. So we need an immortal Whitmore Captain's Talisman. Again. Keep needing these summons, huh? Oh, uh, let's see. Alright, so title of Lightning King is more of a burden than an honor to him. Force okay. Not giving me any good information yet. More he trained in martial arts, more powerful he became. Okay. He's a warm and gentle heart. If you can help him, he'll be able to suppress his powers and return to life of peace. Alright, we got our next clue. So wait, is there someone trying to fight? No, okay. Oops. Clue number four. The Bishop Yellow Talisman. It's awesome, but it's not good enough to pay for all my troubles so far. I can't let it in like this. Okay. So, clue number four. So, to work on clue four, you got to come back to Craftmaster uh, Eogisk in the Spiritual Center. Come to the Craftmaster, and we have to do this Immortal Whitmore yet again. This is the one that is in Magic Square 4F. So I'm going to go ahead and craft my two uh, summons for him, just in case. It, you know, sometimes you don't get the item on the first try. So we're going to go ahead and craft two of those, and we're going to work on that boss. All right, guys. So for the next step of the scroll, this is going to be clue number four. We need to get another talisman from the steel bone dude here. So that's what we're going to do. All right, so the talisman comes from the chest here. So there's a chance to get it, might not get it. To wait and see. If anyone got one, let's see. Me, I did not get one. So we're gonna spawn again, keep it going. All right, so we just finished our last boss here. We did quite a few. Um, trying to see if we get I've gotten two of the things so far, um, but it looks like for the rest of the quest, I'm going to need three. Um, so we're just trying to knock that out. So basically, you come up here to Magic Square 4F to the ceiling chamber to uh, get this uh, talisman. So I got three now. That's what we were looking for. Uh, I should be good on those now. All right. Now that you have the uh, Immortal Whitmore's talisman, we must go back to uh where is it it's the center shire yeah 
and NPC. I believe it's Swing. All right, so then we're gonna talk to Wayne. And we're gonna get the fourth clue. All right, saying it can be used to make a serum that's as miraculous as the millennial fruit. But the recipe is unknown. You need inner force to digest and absorb the serum, right? If you're able to absorb the serum as strong as this, you must be a powerful potential warrior. I've been requested to process this, and that's what I'll do. It's none of my business whether this will be used to save or kill someone, okay? Here we go, we got the next clue. Mystery. And clue number five says, everything started with Joe Gill and no, and they're now paying for what they did. I think it all ended quite well. And Gion and we actually look good together. Ha! Uh, I should keep this arcane archer's horn safe for it now. What horn is that? Uh, let's see. Did he take my talisman? All right. So you can see he took a talisman. And that is that. Now this next step is actually only available at level 80. And then we're going to go talk to Na Nahion. There we go. Let me get clue number five. Uh, he's talking about the serum. Let's see. Have you heard about the poison witch? Master of the poison arts. Nothing is certain. I can tell you. You need a uh, be beastly, the fairy Act king's token. I'm sorry. I cannot be of any further help to you. Okay. So our next clue says Sondok. He's abusing my goodwill to take credit for himself. He's cold and calculating. What a jerk. But that really, what really matters is that I've saved a life. I should keep this arusonite with me so for the next step you're going to need to craft the beastly nefariox king summon and fight him he's level 80 to do that we're going to port to the craft master in uh, spiritual center now at the craft master this is where all the summons are it's where we've been doing our summons for our mystery requests if you've been following along um, so you first need to do the beastly nefariox and you can see that in scroll number one of this series Which is balance trickster wom um, If you skipped over that for whatever reason either way if you've gotten this far you should have went to summon this boss You probably gonna need to summon him again and get more of the talisman the reason why is you need the talisman to uh, Create the beastly nefariox king summon now. I would make one right now, but uh, my friend already has one so I don't necessarily need to make it. I'm, I might not need to make it. And we're kind of just trying to hold on to what we have. I would need to go get another talisman if I'm going to do it anyway. Um, but there's other bosses we're going to have to summon along the way. So for now, he has, I believe, one or two of those for us to try to get those items. And this is one that you summon in the secret area. And I don't believe I've covered it on the channel. Um, but, you know, it's part of this scroll, so I have to cover it, let you guys know where it's at. So I can go ahead and do that and show you guys. So to get there, you need to go to Heaven's Way Peak, upper level, and you want to end up in this top left corner. So we're going to, I think we're going to go to this landmark up here. Yeah, the steam fold. We're going to port there. Now, once you're up here, you want to get on these uh, rocks out on the ledge. And you actually see, you can see from here, it's, it's right over in this area. So what I'm going to do is I want to fly, but hit a wall. So we're going to go for that ledge right there. Just because it's going to be easier. And you're going to have to do a double jump to get over here. Now, we want to get down there. But it might be easier to go up first. And just to get a better view. Yeah, so here we go. You're going to end up down here. And then all you got to do is walk into this bush. That's going to bring you into the Cryptic Sanctuary. The map looks like this. Oh, no, we can't look at the map. You can look at the map over here on the mini map. You can't really see. Uh, I mean, there's no mobs or anything here. There's just some locked areas and some of these summoning things. And for the King, uh, Beastly Nefariox King, you're going to come to this crystal right here and summon him here. See, Beastly Nefariox King summoning scroll. So we will do that in a bit and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so I actually forgot to start recording before we spawn this, but we are on the boss that we're going to need for the to get the next item. 
This is the Beastly Nefarious King, and I don't know what the deal is with these bosses, but that Steel Bone boss in in 4F is is like the worst. Like I don't know what his deal is, but he's the one that can basically one shot you with his dash, his like straight line move. The rest of it, like this boss is level 80. Yeah, it doesn't have a move that hits us that hard. I mean, I'm getting out the way of some of these, but we pretty much test every move at this point, and nothing will really kill you. So I don't know. It's kind of weird how this is seems to be easier than the other one. That's level 75, and this is level 80. But either way, you, like I said, you have to come into the Cryptic Sanctuary to spawn it. It's where I showed in a little bit ago. And um, yeah, so this is going to drop some chests, and we're hoping to get the item out of the chest. Alright guys, so we just got the item. That's what we were looking for. Um, it is this uh where is it? There it is. The Beastly Nefarious King's token. This is what we need to turn in for the next clue. Alright, now that we got our item, we're gonna go to Phantom Woods. And it's up here at the docks. I don't remember who exactly it is. Uh, just go to one of the dock folks here. I think this might be it. You listen. Let's see. Uh, oops, I didn't mean to take the request. Is it her? Yeah, there we go. Turn that bad boy in. All right, we gotta go see Master Chion. He's in Heaven's Way Peak Lower Level. Heaven's Way Peak Lower Level. Um, so I believe it's out in this little area right here. So what can we port to Landmark? Here we go. We'll go to this Bloodshade Trap. All right, then we're gonna walk down this path over here to the left. And come down here. Probably should have mounted, but that's okay. And here's the green light. Boom, Lightning King, Chion. Thought you're dead by now with your pathetic skills. <laughs> it's an honor to help the Lightning King. I think I'm ill. Oh. They said we did well. Alright, he seems to be pretty happy with us. And we are done. That wraps up the third scroll. Got our items there. And we unlock the next scroll. There we go. All right. That'll be in the next video. Thank you guys for all the support. If you're enjoying the videos, make sure you hit that like button down below. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments. If you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. Turn those notifications on. I'll catch you guys in the next video.